Hi friends, I filmed my entire weekend and the video wound up being over 30 minutes long so I decided to split it into two parts. Enjoy part 1. The construction wasn't constructioning this morning. I know. Let there be light. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. When you look at my pimples, just know that at one point they weren't there. Let me get some good lighting for a powerful Hi Friends. Hi Friends. D and I, <laughs> we're in our pond today and we're just gonna be some silly gooses. More specifically, tonight D and I are going to a fancy smancy restaurant, then sleeping over at my parents' house because tomorrow we're all going to California Adventure. That will be part two. This is the most we have done in years and I am swimming in serotonin. Smiley face. And now I'd like to introduce a new segment called Disney Adults. I think that Dee is a beautiful mix between Snow White and Princess Jasmine. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. I think that you're the perfect mix of Sleeping Beauty, but also Cinderella. Oh, I love Cinderella. But also a twang of bell. A twang of bell? Are you serious? Yeah. That is so generous of you. And now I shall capture the wild D moving her habitat for the day. I'm just folding up my bed. This is part of our daily routine. Morning routine 2021. <laughs> That's where I put all my stuff for the next night. And then when she pulls it out in the evening, I know it's time. It's time to waddle on over to the bathroom, get ready for bed, and try to go to sleep. An attempt is made. This in toe form. One time I almost made, I almost used my mom's feet. I wanted to start selling feet pigs. <laughs> she just like always has such nice pedicured toes, <laughs> like normal length toe nails. When she has normal length toenails. <laughs> Every day, Dee and I have been taking one of these bad boys. It's called a wellness shot. The best way to describe it is battery acid. It feels like fire in my throat and it just really gives me a lot more compassion for dragons. Is this what they feel like 24 seven? Have they ever felt peace? That's the exact thought that came to my mind the first time I ever smoked weed. <laughs> My mom told me when I was a little kid, don't want to smoke because you have little hairs in your lungs and if you smoke, you'll burn those happy hairs. <laughs> and I've thought about those hairs every day of my life my since. Mom's so <laughs> don't smoke or you're gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> so the ingredients, back to the wellness shot, are ginger, lemon, and cayenne. And the lemon is so sour, it gets me right in the twangers where I'm like <laughs> And <laughs> the cayenne gets me right in the throat. Would you like to witness some pain? I kind of like it though. Not the pain so much, but the flavor underneath all the pain. You did it! <laughs> See, help! <laughs> What's going on? It is. You did not see it this morning. They did. They know what I'm talking about. What happened to your hair? The cow came. <laughs> the cow came home. The cow was licking away? Yes. Extra soft. Alright, you and I are gonna do some transformations. I'm gonna play Emma Chamberlain's podcast while I do my makeup. I hope you're having an amazing week. 
I hope you're having an amazing day. Thank you so much, Emma. By the way, I switched from a makeup bag to a makeup backpack, mostly because I just love this backpack so much. I wanted a use for it. And the makeup aspect of it has been so perfect. I'm not stuffing things in. It just all fits so nicely is what I'm trying to say. And it's so cute. I just finished my makeup. Let me go to the light so we can get a good look at it. Um, I'm not sure about this light. I gave up. I have to pick out an outfit. Do I hear a wild D? Hi. Oh my gosh, hi. That was pretty quick. We can go hours doing our makeup and that was just 20 minutes. These have changed in a good way. When we're back and we're better. <laughs> <laughs> so for tonight, what are the vibes you're getting? Like, um, are you thinking of jeans and a cute top? Yeah. Okay. I was like, I mean, should I wear a dress? <laughs> but like, no, that's too much. That'd be amazing. You can do whatever you feel. Even though I have no idea what I'm gonna wear, I know pants. I'll be wearing pants. <laughs> Who wears pants in your relationship? <laughs> My thing is, I always just go for the comfies, but we'll see what happens. Let's let's just see what happens, yeah. This is where I need to keep myself in check because I just saw this comfy and I was like, oh, but no, we're going to a nice restaurant. I can do better, but can I? What if I just wore the hoodie form of the t-shirt I'm already wearing? SpongeBob! Ravioli, ravioli, give me the formioli. <gasps> what if I wore this? That's the only thing that's had the right vibe for tonight so far. Maybe I should just go with that because that's what spoke to me in this moment. And it's all about living in the present. This is what I got. Same original top that first spoke to me. Shoes with the silver heels to go with all the silver things I have going on. But I think that an argument could be made for it being safe. Maybe a little bit boring. I mean, I shouldn't just throw caution in the wind and wear this dress, right? Even though it matches my nails. It matches my nails. Wait, hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, this is just special because it's a dress and it matches my nails and I have a spray tan. So it's like a very rare sweet spot that I would even wear this dress. And I think I should take advantage of this time. But do I wear silver jewelry or gold jewelry? Gold purse that matches the moon or black purse. I'm gonna do gold. I'm gonna do gold. Okay, I have all my gold accessories on and these cuties caress your face. Even though I have no idea what I'm gonna wear, I know pants. I'll be wearing pants. I don't know if I'm seeing things, but I think I just saw an angel. <laughs> we are right by the entrance. So POV, you walk in and this is what you see. <laughs> She's working right now. <laughs> awesome. You look like you're in a movie. I feel like I'm in a movie. Em said she was about to be on the red carpet, just leaving the car because that's how big this moment feels. <laughs> Water reveal. Excellent. No flavor, just cold. First bite. How do you feel? Rejuvenated. That flavor? Look at that dress. Look at her. I have a confession. So I didn't wear pantaloons. I didn't wear underwear. Interesting choice, I know. But what I didn't discover until now, my dress has these little hooks all the way down. So technically, there is this much space where anyone can see what I have going on. AKA, you're just giving the people what they want. <laughs> Everyone's a gynecologist here today. <laughs> okay, wow. Dreams are coming true. Let me write this evening. <laughs> First bite, I mean drink, I mean sip. It is so good. Oh my gosh. I just wanna go swimming in it. Oh, oh, oh yeah. That tastes like trouble. <laughs> Cheers to vlogging. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, you love vlogging so much. Here's some for you. Guacamole, check. I could just eat this and be so happy. Totally, just with a spoon. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a feast. I feel like this is Hook with their feast scene that I love so much. I'm not sure, but yes. <laughs> Our waitress then informed us that we have to try her favorite cocktail. What are we gonna do? Say no. Pineapple margarita. Oh, it's so fresh. <laughs> it's getting a little bit darker outside, so the restaurant decided to set the mood and turn all the candles on. And it's, I'm gonna be honest, it's making me feel a certain type of way. <laughs> what kind of way is that? I think you know. <laughs> Dark lighting and candles? Whoa. You look like you have an afterglow right now. <laughs> We had our two drinks. I thought it would end there. Then a dessert cocktail sounded so right. My grandma's waiting for me at the house. Got it. Shut first. <laughs> <laughs> it's a green plug. Do you see that? Is that a butt plug? <laughs> it's gone, girl. I thought the view was gorgeous, but I thought she was gorgeouser. Here, let me get you in front of the sunset. <laughs> oh my gosh, gorge. There's a thousand people behind me. <laughs> oh, okay. I just want to crawl on you like a spider monkey, so... Feel free. That's where I'm at. Feel free, there's no rules tonight. Oh my gosh. The lift. Imagine how many people are jealous of me right now. <laughs> Zero. I felt like Nick Miller and she was trans. You are a big baby. <laughs> and Nick's like, yeah, I am. You are a huge baby. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh, this is such a beautiful moment. Oh. Physical touch is one of my love <laughs> language. <laughs> I'm feeling like Courtney and Travis right now. <laughs> Hot take? Emotions? Sometimes good. <laughs> Only sometimes though. Sometimes catastrophic, but sometimes beneficial. <laughs> if you haven't watched Shit's Creek, it's so good. And it's like more than one character. Right. I love them all. And now for an impromptu dance recital. Seven. Bomb. Hello, old chap, old spot. <laughs> you hear those frogs? They're communicating. I feel like vampire number three in the Volturi. <laughs> Is that his name? He has a name. Vampire I just don't remember. Number A bit perspiry, and I think that's my cue. Yeah. It's my call time. What about you, D? I think the same. Okay, love and kisses. But then, as we were getting out, a moth decided to get in. A big moth flew into the jacuzzi. I finally got her out, and she's drying off right now, but she's going in the wrong direction. A few minutes later. Hello, just here with Mothra, trying to offer her my towel to dry off. She's giving me such. She's Feelings. giving you puppy eyes. We're here to support you. Her will to live is so inspiring. She's like, ooh, pretty light. <laughs> We've all been there, Mothra. Mm -hmm. Many times. <laughs> like, why are you moving your head like that? Is she telling me off and mothly? <laughs> um, either that or she's saying thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you have your own system. I'm not gonna question it. Yeah. You know more about being a moth than I. I guess I'll turn the jacuzzi light off so we don't get confused again. You're gonna have quite the story to tell your friend. She's gonna be sore tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> so glad we were lifeguards on duty for that. Bring in the dancing lobsters. Ooh, that's me. Mom! What? Hi! Hi! <laughs> that's all I wanted. Hey, Cleo. You look so hot. Go off. Me? Yeah. Since what? <laughs> Since forever. Send me this. Okay. <laughs> When she says that she's not a stage five. 
Emma, are you a stage five? I've had my stage five moments. <laughs> Have you ever not been a stage five? No. Is that something you'd like to work on? Or is that something where you're like, I know who I am <laughs> and that's just how it's gonna be. Honestly, if I'm being honest with you, it's a little bit of both. I would love to not be a stage five, but at the same time, I know I'm such a stage five. <laughs> <laughs> I just want all the attention. Okay. I just want all the attention and all of everything. Is that too much to ask? <laughs> I mean, for the most part, no, but he should be able to have the healthy, good relationships in his life without you getting J-word. Oh, of course. Well, then that's fine. It's not the best. I hate feeling like a stage five. I want to just not care at all. It's good to care. It's great to care, but I find myself always caring and then getting my feelings hurt. You've had horrible experiences that don't represent what is to come in your life. Oh my God. I just realized that the next person that will see me naked will have never seen me naked before. <laughs> Alexis. David. We do it again. David. <laughs> John. <laughs> I couldn't find the pants that I wanted to wear, but I did find these shorts. I went to Disneyland with my family right when the Star Wars land opened up and there were stormtroopers everywhere. Yeah, you already know where I'm going with this. The stormtroopers are kind of hot. Good night, Minxie. Good night, little Minxie Poo. I'm gonna catch some Zs and then tomorrow I'm gonna catch some Pokemon. Oh my gosh. Thank you for reminding me. I need to get egg incubators. <laughs> me too. We're gonna walk so many steps tomorrow. I can't stop thinking about it. I'm so excited. We're gonna be 12, 3 30ing all day, but like in a magical area. Exactly. We'll actually have somewhere to walk to. <laughs> right. Not just up. Stairway. <laughs> you have sweet dreams. You have. Spicy kind of dreams. <laughs> wow, thank you. Good night, love you. Love you. Have a good shower. Finally in bed. It's around 2 a.m. Let me see what time it is. Oh, it's 2.40 a.m. Okay, not bad. It's been so much worse. I also just shed about 10 eyelashes from this eye and this eye only. <gasps> Not again. Sweet dreams. Good night. Keep your eyes peeled for part two. Kisses for my bitches. And here is all the love. Just for you.